Hello guys, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial, in this After Effects tutorial, we are going to create this. Here I have already created a new composition for this slower third tutorial. Now let's start with adding the main text. Here I am using Montserrat font family. Change font style to extra bold. Change font size, here I will set it to near about 110. Now adjust the position, place it at center. Perfect. Now let's add subtext. Here I will set font size to near about 50. Place it below the main text. Let's change font style to semi bold. Now select the rectangle tool. Make sure you have not selected any layer. Make sure fill option is set to solid color. Stroke option is set to none. Now create shape hiding the subtext layer. Place this shape layer below the subtext. Perfect. Now for this shape layer, adjust the anchor point as shown. Press Y key on your keyboard, now select anchor point and place it as shown. For this shape layer, in effects and preset, search for fill, add fill to solid layer. Here you can set any color of your choice for this fill. Now for shape layer, press S to bring up scale, at 1 second, create keyframe for scale. Unlink the scale, now at start, change scale value for Y axis to 0%. You can see the preview. Select keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now slightly adjust the speed graph as shown. Perfect. Now place this layer at 10 frames. Now we will create duplicate of this layer. Press Ctrl plus D to create duplicate. Now 5 frames forward, place it at 15 frames. For shape layer 1. We will change fill color to white. You can see the preview. Perfect. Now let's create duplicate of shape 2 layer. For shape 3 layer, we will remove the scale keyframes. Perfect. Place it above the subtext layer. Position subtext at 15 frames. For subtext, change track mat to alpha mat shape layer 3. For subtext press P to bring up position. Add 1 second and 15 frames. Create keyframe for position. Now at start of the layer, change position as shown. You can see the preview. Select keyframes. Change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now slightly adjust the speed graph as shown. Perfect. Now for this subtext layer, we will create the end animation keyframe. Now at 2 seconds and 10 frames. 
create keyframe for position, add 3 seconds and 10 frames. Change position as shown. Perfect. Now for main text layer. We will create a shape layer to hide the text. Make sure you have not selected any layer. Select rectangle tool. Now create shape below the main text as shown. Perfect. Now place the shape layer 4 above the main text layer. For text layer, change track mat to alpha inverted shape layer 4. Perfect. Now for text layer. Press P to bring up position. Add 1 second, create keyframe for position. Now at start, change position as shown. You can see the preview. Select keyframes. Change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now slightly adjust the speed graph as shown. Perfect. Now at 3 seconds. Create keyframe for position. At 4 seconds. Change position value as shown. To match subtext animation with the main text, you can adjust the position of the keyframes. Perfect. Now for shape layer 1 and 2, we need to trim them at 3 seconds. Perfect. Now we will create duplicate of shape layer 2. For shape layer 5, we will remove the scale keyframes. You can place the layer at 3 seconds or trim it till 3 seconds. Now at 3 seconds, create keyframe for scale. At 3 seconds and 20 frames, change scale value to 0%. You can see the preview. For this shape layer we need to change position of the anchor point. Now press Y key on your keyboard, now select the anchor point, change its position as shown. You can see the preview. Select keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease, now slightly adjust the speed graph as shown. Perfect. Now let's create duplicate of shape layer 5. You can place this layer below or move 5 frames forward both works the same. Change fill color. You can see the preview. Perfect. Now let's create a null object. You can select all the layer, or leave layer 5 and layer 6. It won't have any effect. Parent it to null object. Now for null. Press S to bring up scale, at 1 second. Create keyframe for scale, at start. Change scale value to as shown. Perfect. Select keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now slightly adjust the speed graph as shown. Perfect. Now let's see the preview. Here our clean lower third is created, 
Thank you guys for watching this tutorial.